3,000 hits, we've heard it, we know it's coming. <laughs> it doesn't happen a lot here, though. You've called a lot of baseball. Can you put into context what it'll mean for this franchise to see Cabrera hit that number? Wow. It's a, I just think of the, the chase to 500 last year and how it, the fun part of that was seeing all the guys that he was passing on the way to 500 so you could talk about their careers. And to me, this is... You are, you realize that's actually a little more exclusive club, the 500 home run, home run club, but the 3,000 hit club, there's just a magic about that number. And the fact that it's only been done twice by two of the greatest players in baseball history, Al Kaline and Ty Cobb in a Tigers uniform, it really is hard to put into context. It's just something that most people will never see again, and at least not in a Tigers uniform. So to me, it's just, it's such a special honor. And you look at the, the select clubs he's going to join, right? 300, 500, and 3,000, that's Willie Mays, Hank Aaron. If you want to go 500, 600 doubles, 3,000 hits, that's Albert Pujols and Henry Aaron. So, I mean, it's just, it's amazing what he's doing. It's, it's truly proof that he is one of the greatest hitters in baseball history. And I think anybody in this ballpark is going to enjoy that moment and remember it for the rest of their lives. Your voice will be attached to that moment. <laughs> Do you have something planned for that 3,000th hit? I was asked, you know, this for the 500th, and this is how I approach it. It's like, okay, make sure you make the call first, right? That's the most important. You have to react to the moment. So that is unplanned because you can't go say, you know, Miguel, could you please hit your home run to right center in Toronto? <laughs> so, so that part is unplanned. So make sure you get the word last year 500 in there. This time, make sure you get the word 3,000 in there. After that, I think you have to have thought about what you would like to say to kind of put it in context or to try to capture the moment. So yeah, I have thought about that. I don't write it down because then, then I'll read it and then that's not good. So I, know, I, I have an idea of what I want to say and just to, again, try to, what is this moment all about? Try to capture that. But it's really making sure, because it's radio, describe this moment and describe it well and then put it into context.